This is where it all began, the Coleman A. Young Municipal Center, City Hall. For Kwame Kilpatrick, the sky was the limit. Who could have predicted it would turn out this way? He had an ability to move people, which, had it been put in the correct direction, could have, could have made a huge impact. As we spoke to people about Kwame Kilpatrick the day after the verdicts, many spoke about what could have been. I, I just think he had a lot of potential, and it's just sad. There's no denying the potential, but somewhere along the way, things took a turn. In a stunning fall from grace, Kwame Kilpatrick was found guilty on 24 of 30 federal charges, the most serious of which, racketeering. It just disappointed a lot of people. I'm one of them, because I thought the young man had a lot of prospects going for him. But up until the verdicts were read, many believe Kilpatrick would walk out of the federal building a free man, but not necessarily because they felt he was innocent. Because that's the state of the city is what it seems to be, you know, so nobody does anything wrong. And thank God that somebody stood up and, and decided to get some justice. And now one day removed from the verdicts, many seem to be ready to turn the page on this sad chapter and focus on more pressing matters, like the future. I'm just ready to move on, so that's a good thing. In Detroit, Malcolm Maddox, 7 Action News.